13 on Your Side Weather Deck is sponsored by Montel Construction, quality made simple. A chilly Tuesday afternoon, but at least, Laura, it's dry, at mm -hmm. least for now. I suspect that may change later in the week. Oh, you know it. It always does, Kurt. We don't get a lot of dry time in the winter. We certainly don't get a lot of warm days either, but we are going to see a few more warm days in the near future after very few. Uh, cold days that we've had this past couple of days stretch. Let's take a look at the weather ball. It is solid red, so always a good sign. And we've got this view brought to you by Countryside Greenhouse of Allendale. Cloudy skies here outside the weather duck, but we are starting to see some blue skies in places. Grand Haven Snug Harbor view showing you occasional glimpses of some blue sky, but we're going to call it mostly cloudy there. Notice the ice in the channel too. Great Lakes are at 10% ice coverage right now, so running a little bit behind on that, but at least we've got high pressure that's going to keep, yes, the cold air here, but it's also going to help erode some of these clouds by the end of the day. And notice a lot of the white that you see in there, the finer white, that's snow cover that we got from this past weekend. So we're going to see current temperatures into the upper 20s, not far to go, but eventually these become more westerly winds as that high pressure moves close by. So that's going to give us a little bit of a cool down into the afternoon, expecting temperatures to peak here within the next couple of hours. And then well, tonight we'll stay down into the lower 20s, not nearly as cold as last night, thanks to south winds that stay at about 5 to 10. That, of course, is going to keep our wind chills in the lower teens through the nighttime. Tomorrow afternoon high is expected to be in the low to mid 30s and wind chills feeling a little bit better than today. So making slow progress in those warmer temperatures, but we are going to see above of average as early as tomorrow and continuing the rest of the week. Now that does come with some snow wintry mix likely as we get into Thursday, but the rest of today I don't think we'll see clear skies, but I do think we'll see some clearing later on and by tonight mostly clear to partly cloudy skies. Tomorrow we start to cloud back up as our next system gets close. I don't think we'll see this moving into West Michigan just yet on Wednesday, but most likely by Thursday morning we're talking snow showers, especially to the north and west, and they're going to be around for the rest of your day on Thursday day and maybe even mixing with a little bit of rain too as temperatures stay in those mid 30s. Now Friday even warmer, so we're going to see this system sticking around and we've got the potential to see once again more a wintry mix, probably more snow, but mixing with rain at times and same thing Saturday. You've got another round of this as uh, that system finally pulls away late Saturday into Sunday. We are going to be looking at another long dry stretch. Let's talk about temperatures too in this long term forecast. Six to 10 day temperature trend above average. So average highs this time of year, 31 degrees, about the coldest they get this point of or any point of the year. And we're going to see likely above average for that stretch. So not a bad winter forecast. We continue with the mild temperatures uh, today, right about seasonable numbers. We've got 30 to 31 on the lakeshore, just under freezing for Muskegon and Holland, South Haven too. inland locations. You'll see about 29 to 30 farther south heading up to 29 in Grand Rapids, Hastings 2 and 30 in Allegan. Your 13 on your side forecast. Temperatures will be above freezing as early as Wednesday, and we hold off on any kind of precipitation until Thursday. It does continue for several days, but this is not big impactful weather. This is light snow that we'll see Thursday through Saturday and then a long dry stretch. We've got another chance for a wintry mix coming much later next week on Thursday. OK, Laura, it looks like we've got a pretty warm weekend. Hey, our you way, know right? what? I was done shoveling this past weekend. I'm glad I don't have to do it for <laughs> a while. Exactly. <laughs> All right. Thank you.